Vibro Dynamics is the leading North American manufacturer of technologically advanced machinery mounting systems for vibration control and machine leveling. Let's take a look at the causes of vibration involved in a punch press. We all know that for every action, there is a reaction. The old theory was to bolt the press down to a massive foundation in a futile attempt to control the tremendous forces. If we take a look at the forces involved, we see that first the ram goes down. The die hits the material, causing the press frame to stretch, building up the necessary pressure in the material. The material then snaps through, resulting in a shock wave that radiates through the foundation and soil. At the same time, the reaction forces radiate back up through the press. The high frequency impact damages the weakest components of the system. App snap through. Reverse load damages connecting rods and other drivetrain components. To reduce these forces, Vibrodynamics pioneered the revolutionary concept of mounting large presses on rubber to absorb the forces. And Vibrodynamics patented internal hydraulic jacks and leveling screws present the additional benefits of fast and accurate leveling of the very largest of presses. Recently, we've installed uh, probably the largest vibro dynamic uh, leveling devices at, uh, at a Chrysler Sterling, Stamler Chrysler Sterling stamping here in Sterling Heights uh, underneath uh, some B++ transfer presses that's probably the largest mounts we've ever installed. The applications work very well and the leveling for the rolling bolsters to roll out properly with these heavy dies and the leveling of the bolster rails are very close in tolerance. They have to be within a half thousandths per foot. Uh, we have yet to find uh, over the past 10 years that we've uh, had to go back and do anything with bolster rails or rework in a bolster rail steel because of any uh, misalignment. With standard type presses without vibro pads to be used underneath, now you're in a matter of setting up jacking systems that do not hold the tolerance as close as the vibrodynamic system. So you can control every corner. The vibrodynamics people, they know which corner we have to raise or lower, and there's a screw in there. It's, it's amazing how it'll, it'll raise it. They know exactly how many threads per inch will give them how many thousandths, like a half a turn, a quarter turn, or one eighth turn. And they'll make their adjustments and set it back down and, and uh, level it, and they're just about right on every time. That's always a uh a possibility that when you're jacking a press to level it, that it gets offline and off-center. And with the Vibro system, you're able to control that very well individually with each mount and just adjust each corner as needed without throwing this press a sixteenth or an eighth or sixty thousandths one way or the other. Four million eight hundred thousand pounds. Uh, and like I say, as if they were moving a piece of paper. They like the systems because once they have them lined up in the location they need to go, then it's a matter of it's a straight up and down situation, adjust, lock the system out, and it's done. Uh, another uh, factor as far as savings in regards to Vibro is the fact that the foundations that are needed to support this equipment have been reduced substantially in lieu of the standard style base plate individual piers that we've seen in the past. So the foundations more cost effective using Vibro Dynamics presses do settle. As big as you can build the foundations, you're going to get some settlement over a period of time. With the Vibro system, you're able to go back and readjust that leveling and bring back the tolerances that you need uh, to run these presses and to run the parts in these presses that need to hold tight tolerances. Where in standard type, uh, the only way you, you're able to go back is to actually physically jack up the press and re-shim and cut shims to make that uh, process work. So we see some, some good advantage to the Vibro system uh, and it's, it's, been a, it's been a good installation tool for us on press erection. If it's not level your transfer will wear out faster and not run properly and also for our dies. For our die uh, squeeze, because we, we set it up uh, within thousands between the bed and the top slide and the, the closer that is the longer life your die has and the better quality part you get out of it. If your press is pre as close to the level as possible, when it comes down and presses, you get an even press on your metal. 
and the even thickness, you don't have as many rips. And they were able to move the center one without moving the outside one, which was the impressive part. And also uh, the time involved. Uh, I thought it was going to take several hours, and to be picky about 10,000, I didn't know if it was worth it. And it took them 10 minutes, and it was definitely worth it. We're right where we want to be now. Just not the savings of the installation portion and timing and uh, the readiness of re-leveling when you need to. There's also the vibration and also the, the impact to the press as far as how it's softening or possibly uh, keeping the wear and tear of the press to a minimum over a period of years. In mechanical driven or electronic servo driven presses, the vibrodynamic pads long term saves the wear and tear of the internal parts of the crown and any mechanical pieces that are on that press. The houses behind the stamping plant were being actually shocked by the impact of the press. So out of necessity we had to figure out a way of putting this press in, eliminating the vibration and keeping it from going down the street, down the curbs, up into the neighbors houses. So at that point we called in Vibro and said what can you do for us to help us eliminate the vibration getting out to the neighbors and the uh, companies across the street. Put our press in, install the pit, install the vibration and dampers. As we stood outside of that press, we could feel the vibration just almost virtually gone. We want to be able to run the machines 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and not have to worry about keeping people up at night in the neighborhood. They're double full. They take the vibration out and they uh, level the press. Vibrodynamics product development and advanced engineering department is involved in pioneering new solutions. But because each installation involves a different set of variables, every job is custom engineered. Vibrodynamics holds periodic workshops and seminars for the plant engineers and millwrights of its customers. Vibrodynamics takes pride in its ISO 9001 quality certification with their consistently excellent ratings for on-time delivery, service, and response time. Whatever type of stamping you're doing, why not make it easy for yourself, your neighbors, and your presses? Call Vibrodynamics and see how our technologically advanced mounting systems can add to your uptime, quality, and productivity. Uh, that's a good system to use all the way around for small presses and for large presses.